Okay, so I just have a quick shitty video here for you. And it's basically involving that the new Joker movie is a metaphor for, like, a metaphor, like, um, you know, the, the way that it's that it's played out. I mean, it not a metaphor, but the way that it is, it's uh, it's aimed towards the end game, and you can actually hear it sounds like they're chanting. You know, the, when the crowd is chanting at one point, it sounds like they're saying, Andrew Yang, Andrew Yang, Andrew Yang. It's, but it's very indistinct on purpose. And basically, we are, we are the clowns. That's what the media makes us out to be. That's the reason why he went on the show. That's the reason why the show wanted him on there is trying to make him look like a clown. But he goes on and he... Can't, can't be made to look like a clown, right? No matter what happens, he always makes the right universe where the shit works, right? Okay? So, ultimately, the entire thing, the entire movie, if you watch it, you should watch it. You should definitely watch it. It's a symbolism for the Andrew Yang campaign what's to come if they don't you know if if they don't d decide to listen you know they're making fun of the clown you know these people are pushed to the edge he says it himself you know the Joker says it himself he says you know I have nothing left to lose when you when you have nothing left to lose what, you, what the hell is the point you know at least with Andrew Yang wants to give everyone $1,000 a month unconditionally, right? And the whole the whole mindset of the, the clowns and the the new Joker movie is to have uh, a whole you know, fuck, fuck the rich society because the rich are just fucking everything up. Right? And that's the whole message. But, uh, you know, it, it, it takes two extremes, and it's it's good symbolism. It's, like, spot on for the game campaign. You can actually hear them chant. They make it, they made an in, indistinct chant that's, sounds, that's supposed to sound like, Andrew Yang, Andrew Yang. It's, what it's exactly what it sounds like. You can hear it in the movie. If you're, if you're listening for it, it's indistinct chant, but that's exactly what it sounds like they're chanting, you know. But that's, obviously, they did that on purpose. But, uh, yeah, the whole thing is symbolism of what's to come. Don't be a dick. It's the message is plain and simple. Don't be a dick. Don't be a fucking dick. Like the one guy, he stabs him. Shouldn't have been a dick. Shouldn't have been a rat. Shouldn't have been a dick. One guy who was nice to him, like, you're the only one who was nice to me. <laughs> Don't be a fucking dick. <laughs> you never know who the fuck you're dealing with. Good moral to the story. But yeah. This is basically what we have going on here. That's all I have for you. I'm gonna leave it at that. I'm gonna leave it at that, sh that short of a video. I know there's no, there's no video here, it's just audio, but yeah. That's a theory. A film theory. Okay. Yeah, film theory. So it's been on film theory guy. Alright. Adios. Hasta luego. Good night. Sleep good. Or have a good day, whatever is happening when you're watching this. Okay. Goodbye. Aloha.